Now, if you fancy a walk this autumn, why not try following the route of a disused railway? As part of our active autumn series, we've been following a group of volunteers who've worked tirelessly to clear up a greenway between Walsall and Lichfield to create a space that can be used by walkers and cyclists. Well, it's part of the old Pelsall to Brownhill section, which has uh, lain derelict for decades. Chris Halpin is in Brownhills for us tonight. And Chris, uh, a lot of the work that has been done has been done there, hasn't it? Well, yes, Samina, they've been hard at work, but the problem here is that that work is very much out of sight and out of mind. And the same can be said for the railway line here. Now, I'm obviously stood in the shadow of Brown Hill's perhaps most popular landmark here, but the volunteers are hoping that the work they've been doing can put this railway line back on the map and be another positive aspect to Brown Hill's too. Swamped, smelly and strewn with rubbish, this is the daunting sight which met Brown Hill's Back the Track volunteers on day one. This is what you can find today, and it's taken 12 pairs of hands, hundreds of hours to get it this way. It was in a real mess. We got mud, litter and water. An awful combination. It has been down to people power. Yeah, us coming down as volunteers, bringing loppers, shovels, rakes, litter pickers, and just getting stuck in and getting it cleared, yeah, and bringing it back to what it is today. The South Staffs railway line was the victim of Dr Beeching's 1960s railway cuts. And when freight trains stopped using the line in the early 1980s, it fell completely silent, becoming a derelict dumping ground for over 30 years. When the volunteers first got to work around a year ago, this whole area was best described as a green, slimy swamp with water about ankle deep. And that's because over the years, some of the local drains had been emptying into the disused railway line. So, as well as clearing back the trees and the rubbish, the major task was sorting out the drainage. Where every time it rains, it's just like a flood coming down. We've just uh, dug a trench. We started about, only about a month ago. Uh, and pleased to say it is working and it's a community thing you know it's uh, we feel satisfied when we, we, we look back and see what we've done and it, it makes it all worthwhile that worthwhile effort hopes to revive long-held plans to turn this into a cycle way to Litchfield encouraging people of all ages to get outside and become more active. I've got three daughters, one of them who is disabled, and we cycle on all disused railways up in the Derbyshire, Monsell Trail, Tissington Trail, that have all had the same sort of thing happen, and it really got my interest going. We'd love uh, to get on a bike from Warsaw and bike it into Litchfield. That is our aim at the end of the day. A valiant aim by a group determined to breathe new life back into something which had long been left to rot. Chris Halpin, ITV News, Brownhills.